Hello guys, Nick Clark here. Welcome to Focus Fitness Training today. Today we're doing our second bodyweight evolution video, okay? And this time we're attacking the chest, okay? Now, in this one, it's completely bodyweight, okay? You don't need a band or a bar or anything for this apart from a door frame, okay? That's the only thing you're going to be using in this um, sort of for this exercise, okay? But the other cool thing about this is it's going to hit every single portion of your chest, okay? You're going to hit your outer portion of your chest, your upper, mid, lower, and middle okay so if you were looking to chisel out your chest then this is the one to do it okay plus obviously because you're going to be doing all the uh, sets to failure okay it's going to give you the bulk that you need as well okay but i'm basically going to show you what i'm going to do now okay so you can go up to the door frame okay and you can get your feet nice and close up to it okay go out hand your hand where you feel comfortable okay contract your abs and then pull yourself in. Contract your chest when you do it, okay? All right, so now as you can see, I'm turning my body towards my arm. Okay, so what you're doing there is you're getting that adduction of the chest, okay? That's gonna hit that middle part of your chest. Okay, so if you're looking to define it in the chest, then like I said, this is the one to do. Okay, so like I said, get yourself nice and close up to the door frame. Hang out, have your other arm wherever you feel comfortable, contract your abs, contract your chest to pull yourself in properly, okay, back down lower, okay. Pull yourself in, okay, immediately from the start, you're hitting the outer, and your upper, mid, lower, and then right at the end, you're contracting that middle part of your chest, your inner pack. Okay? Now, <coughs> like I say, hit every part of your chest there, but you are getting some activation from the bicep in this exercise, uh, as you may have noticed, okay? But as long as you contract your chest in this exercise, then you'll be able to leave the bicep out of it a lot more. Okay, so don't worry, you're not actually working your bicep uh, like you would on a pure bicep exercise, where you just concentrate on your biceps, Okay, it is there just to help contribute a little bit because this is technically a pulling exercise. Okay, but like I say, as long as you contract the chest properly, then you'll also be able to leave the bicep out of it more. Okay, but with this exercise, you do need a good mind muscle connection. Okay, you need to make sure that you've got that there so that you can feel the muscle contracting properly. Okay, and so that you can get the benefits from the exercise. Okay, so make sure that you've got that good mind muscle connection and that you can do this properly, okay? Otherwise, you're not gonna really sort of get the results you want, okay? Um, obviously, now I'm gonna perform it on the other side in a minute, but first, like I said, you wanna be doing sort of three sets of this, but you wanna be doing your rep ranges to failure, okay? I'm not gonna set like 10, 12, or anything like that, because, you know, muscles don't, don't count, basically, okay? They, they only know tension, they only know time under tension. Okay, so do them to failure or even pass failure. Okay, and that way you will obviously not only chisel out your chest but bulk it as well. Okay, because it will give it that time and attention for longer. <clears throat> okay, so like I say, to failure or even pass failure to sort of get that change in your body and challenge yourself. Okay, anyway, I'm going to show you on the other side uh, what we're doing. Okay, so just get it set up there. Okay, again, get yourself up to the door frame, okay, All right, hang out, and you can see from the moment when I start the exercise right there, that is activating the outer pec, okay, as I get to right here, it's obviously activating my upper, mid and lower, okay, as I get right to the end, okay, obviously you can see the inner part of my chest working as well, okay, and contracting. Okay, so go out again, and then go in. Okay, as you see there, there, see right there, and it's obviously activating there. Contract your abs, okay. Okay, make sure you pull yourself all the way in, okay. Make sure that you are working your chest and contracting your chest to do the work, okay. Not your bicep. Okay. And then that'll work that, okay? 
Anyway guys, that is how you do your door chest chiseler. And it gets that name because it does actually, like I say, chisel out the chest and give it the bulk that you need, okay? So like I say, this is one you wanna be doing, especially if you wanna be hitting those inner pecs, okay? And getting some massive overload and bulk and, and sort of change in a different way, okay? Um, anyway, that is the second bodyweight evolution video in the books, okay? Um, I hope you liked it. Uh, I hope you found it informative, guys, obviously, uh, but also make sure that your nutrition is in check before we go, before I leave this video, okay? Uh, it's all very well, um, guys, doing the exercises, okay, and putting hard work in. Just make sure that your nutrition is in check, okay? You're not eating crap all the time. Make sure it's a healthy, balanced diet, okay? You can have some cheat stuff, okay? But you need to make sure that your sort of nutrition is obviously going to give you, give or you're going to have in the right stuff to give your muscles the right nutrition that they need, okay? So that they come back bigger, better, better, and stronger, okay? So make sure you're eating a healthy, balanced diet. But like I say, you can have some cheap stuff every now and again, okay? But make sure it's more or less mainly healthy stuff that's going to give your muscles the right nutrition that they need, okay? But like I said, obviously, that is the second bodyweight evolution video in the books. So I hope you liked it. Obviously, give it a thumbs up and a like if you did. Uh, like I said, don't forget to follow us on Instagram, Twitter, as well as Facebook uh, and YouTube. Don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel, Focus Fitness. Okay, obviously, if you think it's going to help a friend out, uh, show it to them, get them to subscribe to the, the channel. Okay, and obviously, if you do subscribe to the channel, you're never going to miss a video. Okay, so you'll be able to follow me every single step of the way. Okay, and get every single video. Um, and I will see you guys in a few days with a new video. Okay, cheers, bye.